There you go. So I've started doing a fan swap because my car's overheating as most TD42s do. I just thought I'd film a bit of it. I saw it online on Nissan Patrol forum or something or other and it's a 1AZ coaster fan. Apparently it pulls heats more, a bit sharper, not deeper. There's the old one, it's got cracks and shit. I don't, I don't know if that's the problem or not, but all at once I'm doing, putting a genuine Nissan water pump in there. Uh, what else have I done? Oh, genuine thermostat. It's a new radiator, it's an aftermarket one, so that's going to be the next step if this doesn't work. But yeah, I've, I forgot to film and I thought it might help some people out, so I just thought I'd start halfway through. All I've done is... I've just taken that radiator shroud off. There's the bottom bit still just sitting there, just take that off. There's the shroud there. And then taking the fan off, four bolts, loosen the alternator and loosen the power steering pump so then can take the viscous hub off and then get to the pulleys and then change the water pump um main reason you'll be watching because of this fan uh, apparently it's a little different pcd by like one mil so got to file these out a tiny bit and maybe massage a bit of this here said with a Dremel or something, but I'm, I don't know, I just have a crack at it with a grinder and a couple files and see how we go. And then, yeah, I'm getting about, what am I getting? I'm getting cruising on the highway. Oh, not in winter, not hot, not under load. It's sitting at about, at 100, it's sitting about 85 degrees. And then, yeah, if I get up over 100, it gets up to 90 pretty quick. And then, yeah, if I go up any hills for a long period of time, it goes over 95, gets up to 100, 105, which I know isn't extreme. They can go up to, they say in the book, 118, but that's probably hot spots get to that, whereas other spots probably get hotter. But, um, yeah, I just want to keep it down. I had an old patrol before this one, and it, um, it ran cool as... Um, no drama, so I just want to get it back to like that, especially once it gets to summer. I'm going to start throwing the tinny. I don't want to be worrying about it. There's the girl there. Slowly getting there. But yeah, I'll get you back on when I start massaging this fan. Cheers. You got the viscous hub off here. Um... Last time I had this off and I put, re -oiled, cleaned it all out, brake clean and re-oiled it. But I don't think I put quite enough in, so I'm just gonna pull this back apart again. And just put a bit more in there. Because apparently it's pretty, gotta be pretty accurate the amount you put in there. Yeah, so it's, just these four bolts, where are they? There, one, two, three, four. Just pull them out and then just gotta get a screwdriver under there. Just pry it apart. Just be careful of that O-ring. That O-ring there, bit of shit light. Don't know what I'm doing, so if I'm doing something wrong, just fucking comment and let us know. <laughs> I marked a line, you probably see there, uh, the amount I've got to put in, and then I just didn't, wasn't patient enough and didn't let it settle, because it's so thick, it takes a while to settle, and then it ends up being a bit above, so now that I'm pulling all the party, I thought I might as well put, a, put that bit extra in. What is it, premium silicon oil? So, I've got the water pump fitted in there. New one. Put a bit, put a bit more oil in there, it's back together. Now I just gotta try and line up the holes and, yeah, try and massage out 
I'm just going to get the grinder because I don't have a die grinder or anything, so it might be a bit rough, but I've marked where I think it's hitting on the black text there, just around the rim and a little bit there on that plastic on each side. That's hitting on these knobs, two of them, and then, yeah, should just have to cut off those. There goes the fucking thing. Should just have to cut off those tabs and then it should fit in. That's those tabs gone. And that little notch out there. That little tab notched out each on each bolt. Bit of steel. I just had to use a grinder and a file, it'd be a lot tidier with a die grinder and then no, that little bit there on opposing sides a little bit of metal but mainly just the fan itself grind that out to fit that tab and then maybe have to file out these holes a bit as i said they're a little bit different pcd but they kind of look like they might go so we'll wait and see little tip don't put the hub back on first, put the fan on the hub because there's just not enough room with the radiator in, so it's only four bolts, but just got to pull it back off and hit the fan to the hub first and then it should be sweet. All right, she's all done, all back together. Got to let that um, gasket goop dry off for 24 hours before I put water in it and then We'll start her up and give her a run. Uh, let us know in the comments if you want to want me to show you the results or do another video of how much it dropped or whatever. I'll film it and let it know. I'll just give a quick look at it back together. Pretty hard to get a good shot of it. Yeah, cheese.